Thanks for joining us as we welcome you today for Saturday Afternoon Football. Anthony Hudson here live. The roof is closed, so we have perfect conditions inside here today. Gary Lyon joins me for this match. Welcome, Gaz. Hey, Hutto. Really looking forward to the start of this one. A practice match on the bill today as these two sides test each other out. Hitting the turf today will be North Melbourne and Fremantle. They're looking sharp, and the crowd are appreciating it. The banners are ready for the players. Fremantle, we've got a talented group in the middle. It's up to whether or not North Melbourne can match them in the centre. Captain onto the field of play. The cheer squad's hard work is paying off. The banners are looking great. The captains make their way to the center circle. For the coin toss. North Melbourne winning the toss. They're just moments away from the opening bounce. The crowd are ready, and we're underway. Tap came from King. The bounce made it tough. Takes it well. Moved on by Gibson. Good body work to win the mark. With a driving kick. Looks up with a kick. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Alex to kick it long. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Spears the ball. Duffy takes the mark. Uses it by foot. Can't take possession. What can you tell us, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Bowers won herself a free. She drives it towards goal. Fremantle, team one home. She sinks her first goal. They get around her after that effort. The first goal of the match. King just slaps it down. King rewarded for that tackle. Great tackle. Great attack on the ball carrier. Puts boot to ball. Kick by King. It's a big kick, and it goes straight through. Look at them celebrate that effort. North Melbourne, get there first. She did really well there, and gets the reward. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. We're back in motion. Won the hit out. Is in her possession. Great mark in the pack. Sinks the slipper into it. Terrific mark there. Ashmore gets the handball away. The ball spills to Duffin. Fantastic pressure there. Drives it out of the pack. Sharp gets on the end of this. Move it on. She takes aim. 
good-looking kick off the boot, and it sailed through. Of course, Hunter. Shah loved kicking that one. Fremantle with a narrow lead. We're back in the middle to resume play. Garner does well. Gets on the end of this. She has the ball. Linking by hand. Thank you, guys. Oh, the umpire calls for a stoppage. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. Good mark by Hardiman. A low stabbing kick. King controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Goes for territory. And the mark will be paid. Bateman wins the mark in contest. Wants to go. Probing kick inside the 50. Couldn't complete the mark. Picked off the deck. Hands that ball to the opposition. Charges with intent. Hits her hard. Shows some physicality. Fighting hard was Miller. Duffin collects the loose ball. Showing some really good pressure there. Finds the loose ball. Puts boot to ball. Gibson hacking it out of there. Elects to kick. Sharp. Got under it. Fans crossing their fingers. Hoping she can put this one through the big sticks. A chance to put a second goal on the board. No issues with that drop mark. Sharp loves that goal. Fremantle lead by 12. The game is back underway. Won it down. King finds possession. Seth there to mop up. Rushes with the kick. Abitanzello wins the ball in the air. 45 metres out. She likes her chances from here. She pops through the goal. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around Abitangelo. North Melbourne now only trailed by six. Guides it down. It'll be a ball up. Slapped away. The ball spills from the tackle. They can create from this. Kane just fends off her opponent. A good mark under the circumstances. The kick from Webb finds this one all by herself. Chips it towards half forward. Great mark under pressure. Works it across the ground. Shah couldn't keep her hands on it. Dug out by Gillespie Jones. Releases the handball. Here's Grierson. Quick hands and they could be away here. Punches the kick. A solid mark from King. Decides to kick. Takes a few deep breaths before this important kick. 45 metres out. Okay. This kick to square it up. The drop punt goes straight between the big sticks. Celebrating hard. That's two in a row for North Melbourne. Scores a level. Guided down nicely by King. With the ball is set. Has a runner alongside her. Applies a bump. Dug out the loose ball. Handballs out in front. Handballs to no one in particular. And now they create a turnover. Gives it to Gaskell. Taken by Duffy. Stewart spent it before she earned it. Just releases the ball. Handballs out into space. Is accepted. Good mark. And looks to send it back. Uses it by foot. Randall takes advantage. Dishes it off. She gets her hands on the footy. King just threw it. Mascot goes the long option. Takes that one strongly. Sharp with a low spearing kick. Ball off hands. I'll have it. Now it's a ball up. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Webb was taken high in the tackle. Fremantle would love to make the most of this opportunity. 65 metres out. 
Breslin moves it now. Good mark there. Gooch slick with the hands. Receives the handball and takes off. At full stride, receives the handball. O'Sullivan puts it on the boot. A strong pack mark. Converting these opportunities could make a big difference to today's results. Bowers uses the body to take that mark. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. Horton presents and takes the mark. They should get a goal from this kick. That's a well-executed kick for a goal. No doubt about it. Horton couldn't be happier with that goal. The Dockers by six points. Umpire ready to resume play. Taps it down. She gains the possession. Just gets it onto the boot. Ashmore got hands to it. Seth doesn't get low enough and gives away the free. Randall sends one up towards the wing. Scoops up the ball. Collected by Bratton. Wants to keep it moving. Hit the man hard. Picking it up was Bannistack. Finding the loose ball was Mascol. Lobs the handball. The loose ball scooped up. A bit too hard with the push, and it's a free kick. Moves it by foot. Just put it on the boot. Difficult ball controlled. Green uses the body well. Got boot to ball. Picks it up. Antonio gets the loose ball. The umpire will ball it up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Carney slips the tackler. Uses it now. Lynch over the top. Riddle works onto that ball. Licks with hands. Doing well was Garner. He sums up the situation and delivers. Yes, Hutto. She acknowledges the crowd. The scores are all tied up. Center bounce. Wins the ruck duel. She's got the football now. Clear free. Just put both hands in the back. Works it across the ground. Stuck the mitts out there and held onto it. Goes with the kick. Gillespie Jones has it. Slams it on the boot. Nice mark under pressure. With a driving kick. Marked by Humphreys. Big kick required from this distance. She heads for home. Did it carry? I think it's a goal. Gets some reward for her efforts. North Melbourne with only a goal lead. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Back in the middle. One down. Seth has the ball. Puts it on the boot. A great mark taken there. Works it across the ground. Ball spills. Gillespie Jones sends one up towards the wing. Kicks it long. Nice mark under pressure. Humphrey drives the kick. Doesn't take the mark. O'Sullivan dug it out. Gets the handball away. Is in her possession. Gibson rides out the tackle. Releases the handball. King Curry kick. A good mark under the circumstances. 50 metres from home.
She decides to go for home. Trend missed an opportunity to mark. Just put her hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Easily takes the mark. Bowers collects the kick. Humphreys looks to get onto the football. Off hands. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Randall kicks it. Gibson runs after this one. Gets the ball out of heavy traffic. The ball ends up going to ground. Duffy goes long and delivers the goal. Pretty happy with that one. Tight contest here. Scores locked up. One down. Has it now. Seth wins the foot race. Kicks hurriedly. At the end of the quarter, the scores are all tied up at 30. Here's Gaz to break down the stats. A critical stage of this one. Thanks for that, Gary. Players ready to start the second quarter. Back in the middle to resume play. King won the hit out. She's got the footy in her hands. With the ball now. Bateman gets the opportunity to have a shot for goal. Looks to move it by foot. Good body work to win the mark. Goes by foot. Garner gathers it now. A great mark taken there. Looks up with the kick. Hardiman marks. Hardiman has resources out wide. Uses it across half back. Ashmore found some space and marked. She takes the mark. King goes with the kick. O'Sullivan gurns a free kick. Chose to kick it. Off hands from Maskell. Thank you. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. Great mark under pressure. Cuts the kick in board. They chase after the loose ball. He gives away a free for in the back. Williams moves it now. Does well to cut off the kick. Randall kicks it to the square. Takes a simple grab. Gets it away. Manages to get a hand to it. Gathers it now. A lot of possessions for her. Ends up turning this ball over. Moves the ball by foot. Antonio with the mark. Puts it on the boot. Where worked hard to get to that point. Horton gathers it now. The drop punt goes straight between the big sticks. A second goal in the bag. She's excited about that one. Fremantle could kick back-to-back -back goals. Now they lead by six. King clears the contest. There's someone on the ground. I think it's Kane. That does not look good. Don't think she'll be coming back. Gree throws the ball away. Punches it clear. She has the ball. Applying the physical pressure. The mark is taken by D'Antonio. Goes by foot. Strong mark in the contest. Towards centre half four. A mark by Kresnan. She can put it through. A 
time to celebrate. Gets her first. She celebrates hard after that. We're all tied up now. Clears the contest. Giving it off was Lynch. It's a turnover. The handball now from Gillespie Jones. Bannister gets the ball. A chance to put one through for her side. This shouldn't be too difficult for Grierson. Looking to kick goal number two. Slams it home. She's enjoying that goal. North Melbourne cut the lead by a kick. That's a really good team goal. It's great to watch her, though. Plenty of excitement. North Melbourne can be very damaging if you allow them time and space. They've been able to find space way too easily today. King thumps it forward. Sarah collected the ball well. Got boot to ball. Spills the mark. Stewart applying physical pressure. Hits her hard. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of footy. Getting pushed out of the way was Antonio. She drives it towards goal. She slots this one. A big goal there. Trent kicks her first. Smiles all round. North Melbourne have kicked the last three goals. The lead is now 12. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. Fremantle can't seem to find the footy. It's pretty simple. If they don't have the ball, they can't score. We're back in the middle now. King with a big fist on it. Picks up the loose ball. Slams it onto the boot. She gets above the crowd. Works it from the back half. Winning the ball in the air was Lefford. Looks to move it by foot. Bowers gets on the end of this. The rooms just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Gone! What a tackle! Great tackle. Intercepts the ball well. The loose ball picked up. Runs it over the boundary line. Thrown in now. Clears the contest. Didn't fumble. There'll be a ball up close to goal. Garner with the punch. Bowers takes it well. Thank you. Ball up calls. What do you make of the game so far, Gary? It's a really entertaining game of football. Marks now and can send it back. Drives the kick hard. Nobody can hold on here. Uses it across half back. Marking in space with Bowers. Going for distance with the kick. Nice hands. Well, when you look at the shots at goal, there just hasn't been enough scoring opportunities being created. Get the ball inside 50 and give your forwards a chance to take a mark. North Melbourne forwards are dangerous anywhere inside 50. They just need to be given a shot. And we'll get a ball up. Punched away. Gooch comes away with the ball. Gillespie Jones doesn't take the mark. She's picked up an injury. Gaz, can you give us more on that? Yeah, definitely something wrong here. She's trying to get off the ground as quick as she can. Williams celebrates with the fans. Fremantle reduced the margin. Thump clear. Well collected on the bounce. Garner coming onto the ground. Now we will get a ball up. Swats it. Fire. 
There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Garner got a fist to it. Used the hands and gives away the free. Sack spears the ball. It's a foot race to get this one. King there to mop up. Bannister brings it out of the pack. Takes that one strongly. She can put it through. No issues with that drop pass. That's her first. Congratulated by her teammates. North Melbourne have a two-goal margin at the moment. Punches are clear. Green now. Manufactures the handball. The handball hits the target. Gillespie Jones gives the don't argue. Doing well to intercept that kick. Gets a hand in. The possession caused a turnover. Collects the loose ball. High tackle. Antonio drives the kick. Picking it up was Green. Thank you, Ivan. Now we've got a ball up. What can you tell us, Gaz? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Duffy just threw it. Uses it across half bat. Found space for an easy mark. Looks like the ball will be coming back. Keeps it moving. Set on the ball. And the mark will be paid. Putting this one through would give the Dockers plenty of confidence. Sinks the slipper into it. Good mark on the run. Hardiman drives a low kick. Gillespie Jones marks in a bit of space. Chose to kick it. Finds this and marks well. The kick from Ashmore. Bannister did well to win that ball. Decides to kick. She looks like she needs a spell. Brutton slams it onto the boot. A solid mark from Gillespie Jones. Kicks to the square. A chance to reload the attack now. Got the hands free. O'Sullivan running off for a break. Ball up in the centre square. Thrashes it. Unable to create the space. Great tackling there, Hutto. Antonio couldn't snaffle it. Duffin scoops it up. Duffin was taken high in the tackle. Looks up with the kick. A big contested grab. Goes with the kick. Hands that ball to the opposition. The ball in the hands of King. They can link up now. Cleanly picked up. Receives the handball and takes off. King won herself a free. With a driving kick. Just dismisses her opponent. Sends the ball inside 50. Marked by Gooch. She puts it out of bounds on the full. Grierson, urged on by the crowd, prepares to kick. An opportunity for a third goal. Great mark. Gooch puts it on the boot. Terrific mark there. Puts boot to ball. Takes a strong mark. Moved on by Antonio. Duffy leaps over the top. Slams it on the boot. Mascol grabs that one. Moves it by foot. Umpire not fooled by that effort. Pays the free kick. Riddle now heading off to the bench for a break. Moves the ball by foot. Takes it well. North Melbourne haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect your forward to kick a winning title that way. Might be too far out to score. 
strong with the body and wins the mark. Uses it now. An easy grab for Gasmore. The ball finds Duffy. Keeps moving. Elects to kick. Miller got under it. 45 metres out. Going for goal number one. What a goal! Miller enjoying that goal. Fremantle close the gap to Tix. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see that she's up and about now. It's great to watch her, though. Plenty of excitement. Back in the middle as the rucks go at it. Garner with the hit. Thank you, I'll have it. And now we'll have a ball up. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm loving what this game is giving us right now. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Hammers it. O'Sullivan gurns a free kick. Chips it towards half board. Finds a target. Antonio will kick from beyond the 50. Going for goal number one. Drops the mark. She just can't get out of the action. Nice work from Bateman. Uses it by foot. A big contested grab. Duffin uses it by foot. Strong with the body. The siren sounds, and that's the end of the term. The scores. North Melbourne, 54. Fremantle, 48. North Melbourne could have controlled the play well and deserve this lead at halftime. Time to take a look at the stats. Fremantle can't get their hands to the footy if they can win more of the ball than they can get back into this game. Thank you very much, Gaz. Well, that's the opening half complete. Don't go anywhere, as the third term is coming up right after this. Ready to begin proceedings in the second half. About to resume hostilities. Thumps it clear. Brutton with the ball. Just got the hands in the back there. Slams it on the boot. Marks that ball uncontested. Goes with the kick. Looks like the ball will be coming back. A stab kick from Stewart. Over the top of the pack. Got boot to ball. Ends up turning this ball over. Kick by Carney. King hangs onto that one. King won out in the square. Collects the loose ball. Thank you, guys. I'll have it. Ball up in the centre square. It's a very tight game right now. Thump clear. Rutten gets right in her face. Great attack on the ball carrier. My ball, says the umpire. Punches it clear. Let him up, Rob Adam. Thrashes it. Dug out the loose ball. Puts the foot down. Keeps the kick low. Marked by Horton. 
penetrating handball. Takes possession. She gets her hands on the footy. Tackle locks the ball loose. She can take off after that handball. She's got the footy in her hands. That goal is a cracker. Oh, look at her. She really enjoyed that one. Fremantle have kicked the last two goals. It's all level here. Some great ball movement there. You just knew they were going to score. That came off the back of some good work further up the ground. Oh, it's tense out there at the moment, Hutto. Umpire ready to resume play. Swatson takes possession. Carney rushes with the kick. Dropped the mark she should have taken. Good body work to win the mark. Gooch works it from the back half. Finds a bit of room to mark. Opportunity for Miller. Sweeping handle. Missed the target. Releases by hand. It's cut off by Cantonio. Winning the ball in the air was Ashmore. Moves it by foot. Sharp wins the marking contest. Keeps going. Looks to move it by foot. It's a <laughs> Fremantle, 55. Lead North Melbourne, 54. Open opportunity for Rutten. Moves the ball by foot. And the mark has been taken. Drives it long. Gets into a good position to take that. Lynch clears the danger for now. Duffy picks up the loose ball. Nails the goal. They get around her after that effort. That's three in a row for the Dockers. Seven points the difference. Bresnan shrugs off the tackle. The tackle over the shoulder. A spearing kick from Carney. Stands tall and marks. Chose to kick it over the top of the pack. Sinks the slipper into it. A chance to reload the attack now. Fremantle are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. With a driving kick. Terrific mark there. She spears the ball. Marks now and can send it back. Decides to kick. Clifford elects to kick. Got hands to it. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She's barely touched the ball lately. It's very tense at the moment. Hammers it. Collected the ball well. Green takes it well. Gets a quick kick away. Stewart uses the body well. Looks up with the kick. Picks up the loose ball. Set collects it. Hurried kick. Horton has it. 45 metres out. She decides to go for home. She bangs it through. She's giving it all she's got this match. That's number three. Gets some reward for her efforts. We resume hostilities. Clears the contest. Putting on the butt was Kane. Ball gets cut off. Towards centre half forward. Stewart marks. 45 metres out. Move it on. Going for goal number one. Strong mark in the contest. 15 metres out. Going for goal number three. Duffy celebrating hard. Fremantle have five unanswered goals. The margin is 19. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. 
they're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Fremantle could have been giving the opposition a chance to move the ball around freely, which is working because they're getting on top once they force a contest. About to resume play. Punched away. King charges with intent. Charges with intent. Williams puts it out in front. A chance for mass goal. The umpire calls for the ball now. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Ball ends up with the opposition. Hardiman had it, lost it. Ashmore was taken high in the tackle. Goes by foot. Grierson takes a strong mark. Uses it now. Great mark under pressure. 45 metres out. Riddle going for number one. Takes the chance and says thank you very much with that goal. Congratulated by your teammates. The Roos go within the three goals now. Fremantle are winning the clearances, but they haven't been effective and they haven't turned them into scoring opportunities. King on top of the ranking points. The opposition need to get a hold of her. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Rushes with the kick. Does well to cut off the kick. Moved on by Duffin. A good mark under the circumstances. Puts it on the boot. Riddle has a great set of hands. Puts boot to ball. She gets above the crowd. Now with a low spearing kick. Antonio presents and takes the mark. Elects to kick. Good mark and looks to send it back. Uses it by foot. She gives chase to the footy. Contests the hard ball. Williams just landed in her back. North Melbourne would love to make the most of this opportunity. 65 metres out. Takes the mark. Gooch looking to rebound with his kick. Kick by Go Sullivan. Kane needs to lift. Maybe the coach needs to get on the phone to her and give her some instructions. Williams got her high there. Williams moves it now. Looks like it's going to be paid deliberate. The kick from Lynch. The loose ball picked up with quick hands. Shows some physicality. King cans it into open space. Gathers it now. Mops up the loose ball. With a driving kick. Bratton looking to track down the footy. Fantastic pressure there. No prior. We'll get a ball up. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Antonio coming on. It'll be a ball up on the outer wing. Thumps it clear. Has it now. Slick with the hands. Kane continues to find the ball. She's been superb today, Hutto. The umpire calls for it. King hurls it away. Ashmore gets on the end of this. Antonio kicks hurriedly. Gibson gets in the way. Hacks it on the boot. Resnick just gets it out of the boot. Showed good control. She's got the football now. Miller picks it up. The ball mopped up. Goes by foot. Riddle marks it. Pulling this one through would give North Melbourne plenty of confidence. Takes an uncontested mark. Bateman goes for broke. Goes wide from behind. 
North Melbourne, the margin, back within three goals. Fremantle have turned the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's where they turn it over which doesn't make it as dangerous. He just sets the ball well. King, not wasting time, elects to play on. Doing well with the mark. Moves the ball by foot. Antonio, determined to reach the ball quickly onto the boot. Nice mark under pressure. Abitangelo lining up now on a 45-degree angle. She heads for home. Just couldn't get it to Kermina. Grierson drops the mark. Just under two goals the difference now. Fremantle have actually turned it over more than the opposition, but they haven't allowed that to translate into scores. That's why they're still in front. Green puts it on the boot. Good grab there for Grierson. Puts it into the 50. Just landed in her back. Fans crossing their fingers, hoping she can put this one through the big sticks. Might be too far out to score. Antonio will be upset with that. She's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. She gets her hands on the footy. Couldn't take it. Haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. You're right, Hutto. She's gone missing lately. Goes by hand. Miller gets in a good position. 50 metres out. Going for goal number two. Unbelievable. And they put it through. Miller getting the crowd involved. Fremantle with the edge right now over North Melbourne. We're back in motion. Thump clear. Garner dug it out. This is Joe Sullivan. She gains the possession. She's having a big game. The mark is taken by Seth. Uses it now. Clifford wins the ball in the air. Fremantle have the lead, but they're allowing plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. King handballs taken well at ground level by Bateman. Abitangelo has a chance to put a second goal on the board. She acknowledges the crowd. North Melbourne now only trail by 11. The umpire set to bounce to restart the game. Kane keeps coming. Dug it out. Quick handball. Just gets it onto the boot. Williams did well to win that ball. Have it. We have one quarter left to play. What caught your eye, Gary? Fremantle will want to keep the foot on the accelerator and finish this last quarter strongly. Let's check out the stats. Fremantle are doing a great job of applying pressure and creating turnovers. It's allowing them plenty of opportunities. Thanks, Gary. We have one quarter of footy ahead of us. Let's go. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. Swats it. She has the ball. Carney got the hands free. Wins the race to the ball. Is in her possession. Doing well to intercept that kick. Decides to kick. And the mark will be paid. Antonio, hurry kick. A chance to reload the attack now. Brutton takes the mark uncontested. Uses it by foot. Good body work to win the mark. The Dockers haven't been able to set up many set shots at goal, but I'm not sure that it's the forward's fault. The ball has been coming in way too slow. You can't expect a forward to kick a winning total that way. Finds the loose ball. Racking up possessions now. Using every ounce of energy she has left. That one rams in the post. It's under two goals now. Teammates break for her. Bateman used the body to take that mark. 30 metres from home. 
She takes aim. That ball comes off the post. Just under two goals, the difference now. Fremantle have turned the ball over a lot trying to play aggressively. It's rare they turn it over, which doesn't make it as dangerous. Gets into some space to mark this. Under pressure, but keeps it alive. Couldn't complete the play. Ball out of bounds. The game has tightened right up. Ball tossed back in. Clears the contest. Ball collected. Decides to keep it alive. Just gives it away. Abitant Jello. Handballs out into space. She makes the kick count. Full price. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around. Riddle. Still time enough to win this one. Receives the handball and takes off. Oh, Sullivan did well to win that ball. Puts boot to ball. Ends up marking uncontested. Elects to kick. Nice work for Clifford. Hacks it forward. Where takes it well? 45 metres out. They're doing really well to choose some time off the clock here. Going for goal number one. Clifford takes the mark. 15 metres out. Going for goal number one. Clifford, love kicking that one. Fremantle, Cleed is now nine. Hammers it, ends up with Bannister. The loose ball scooped up. Garnick is blowing hard after that effort. Goes the long option. A quick handball from Abitangelo. Umpire tosses it in. Thump by King. They can create from this. Movement by hand. Well, it'll be a ball up near the boundary line. Thumps it clear. Spins past the tackler. That tackle just too high. A spearing kick. Stands tall and marks. Williams drives the kick. Takes an uncontested mark. Pokes it short in the back pocket. Good mark by Gooch. Goes with the kick. A race for the loose ball. Just put it on the boot. Couldn't quite with the mark. And we'll get a ball up. The players will be feeling it out there. Punches it clear. Didn't get away from the tackle. Showing some really good pressure there. Great tackle. Beautiful tackle, Hutto. King uses it by foot. Hacking it out of there. Bateman wins it back. Gillespie Jones couldn't complete the tackle. Dishes it off to a player on the run. And the umpire calls for a stoppage. Thrashes it with the ball now. Greve can't hold on to the tackle. Ball hits the deck. Puts on a bump. Scoops up the ball. Awkwardly got the handball out. Gets around the imaginary opponent. Sweeping handball from Gillespie Jones. She's put it through. That's her second. She celebrates hard after that. They trail by less than a goal. Centre bounce. King just swats it away. She's got the footy in her hands. Trent couldn't snaffle it. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She needs to find a way into this game. Umpire calls for the ball. Punched away. Controlled well off the bounce. At full stride, receives the handball. Gibson sends the drop pan on its way for another goal. Gooch couldn't hang on to the ball. Look at her. She really enjoyed that one.
The game is back underway. Clears the contest. Sells the dummy. Bateman struggling to run at the moment. Puts it into space. She's getting a lot of the ball, guys. She's setting the example at the moment. Grierson kicks it. Goes off the ground. The ball spills to Webb. Thank you. Ball up in the centre square. The players will be feeling it out there. Green contests the hard ball. Gives it, don't argue. Stabs at the kick. Trying to avoid everything out there. Hands that ball to the opposition. Handballs. Garner gets the loose ball. Thump clear. Practicing some fancy moves. Using every ounce of energy she has left. Thumps it clear. Somehow got the ball out. Garnet might have overworked herself there. Took her eyes off the ball. Gets the loose ball. Constant pressure and rewarded. Uses the hands instead of the body. And it's a free kick. Breslin has resources out wide. King throws the ball away. Puts it on the boot. The mark has been taken. O'Sullivan goes with the kick. Good opportunity for the Dockers to put a goal through here. Sinks the slipper into it. Takes the mark. Advances now. She can't hold the mark. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. She hasn't had the impact we were expecting. Ashmore throws the ball away. This is kickable by her standards. Normally a good shot on goal. 40 metres out. She likes her chances from here. Brilliant stuff. And she puts it through. Smiles all round. It's on again as Fremantle take back the lead. Winning it was King. Bresnan pushes through with power. Cleanly picked up. Sends it clear of the contest. Strong mark in the contest. Slams it on the boot. Keeps it alive under some pressure. Gillespie Jones wins the ball in the air. Got boot to ball. Intercepts the ball very well. Moved on by O'Sullivan. She's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. They'll snatch the lead if this goes through. Just hits the post and a minor score. This game is still alive. Takes a nice mark. Kane with a penetrating handball. Williams just put it on the boot. Dug out by Breslin. We'll get a ball up. The game has tightened right up. Punches it clear. Releases it under pressure. It's a poor kick. And it hits the behind post. Kick by Williams. Takes that one strongly. Antonio pushes a low ball. Uses a short handball. Carney with the intercept. Not sure what the problem is from here, but something is definitely wrong. Going straight to the rooms doesn't look good. Punched away. It'll be a ball up. Swats it. King controlled the difficult ball. Randall takes the mark. Chose to kick it. Ends up turning this ball over. O'Sullivan searches for a teammate downfield. Just put her hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Brutton collects the kick. Gibson with an easy mark. Moves it by foot. The ball ends up with Riddle. Looks up with the kick. 
clean pick up by Krasnan. Just got the hands in the back there. Looks to move it by foot. Kane looking a bit sluggish out there. A big contested grab. Two in a row for Fremantle. Fremantle by eight points. They can link up now. Takes possession. Carney steals possession. Scoops up the ball. Mops up the loose ball. Sharp missed an opportunity to mark. I haven't seen her for a while, Gaz. Yeah, she's barely touched the ball, Hunter. Landed in her back on this occasion. Made the tricky bounce look easy. Has to do better in that mark contest. She can put it through. Wow! How good was that? That's three goals now for Miller. She's enjoying that goal. 14 points the difference. She knew that was home as soon as it left the boot. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. Back with another set of bounce. Thrashes it. She's got the football now. Grierson had it, lost it. Williams with quick hands. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? There's some great skills on display right now. It's a great match. Antonio won herself for free. Puts it on the boot. Gooch controlling the airwaves on this occasion. Moves the ball by foot. Stuck the mitts out there and held onto it. Williams uses it by foot. Doing well to intercept that kick. King puts it on the boot. Easily takes the mark. Alex to kick. Intercepted. Uses a short handball. Garnet might have overworked herself there. Marks now and can send it back. Goots moves it now. Strong with the body and wins the mark. Linking by hand. O'Sullivan moves it by hand and now they're away. Pushes off the tackler. Getting in the way was Riddle. Hits the target by hand. It's marked by Antonio. Fremantle are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. She blasts it through for another. Knows where the goals are, and she's got four. They were down at one stage, but never out, and they've found a way to get the result in the end. How did you see that one, Gaz? A massive missed opportunity for North Melbourne. They got themselves into a good position and then just fell apart at the seams. A really disappointing result. Thanks, Gaz. Yeah,